What up guys? It's my second push day of the week. I got my blue drink. I got my blue outfit. This drops on the 28th of March. Got Gymshark down the side there. Um, we'll put a link in this video for it. You can go check out the, the website. Again, this won't be dropped until the 28th. And then, uh, yeah, so my split lately has been Monday push. Push consists of chest, triceps, and some shoulders. Tuesday is gonna be pull, back, traps, rear delts, and biceps. Wednesday is my legs and core, then I have an off day on Thursday. And then Friday, I'm back in here and I'm doing push again. Um, my push that day is gonna be chest, same thing, chest, shoulders, and triceps, but with more of an emphasis on the shoulders and triceps. Um, today, again, we're back doing some back work, but really focusing on uh, a lot of those pulling muscles that don't often get used, trap three, rhomboids. So we're gonna be, again, it's a, it's, a, it's a pull day, so we're gonna be hitting biceps as well. A little bit different of a focus in this workout. So I'm gonna drink my blue drink, we're gonna warm up, and uh, we're pretty much, we're gonna start with a back and a rear delt exercise, and we're gonna be supersetting a little bit more than we would also in the beginning of the week. So. movement off that ground. So rotate the shoulder blades back. So it's that scapular retraction. And then you're initi initiating with your arms. So just, just enough, you know, we want to use biceps as minimally as possible. And I know that sounds weird, but you got to focus on how am I taking biceps out of this movement? Retract, retract, pull that back, and then squeeze at the top. And then that eccentric, there is none. Maybe just let that weight fall down, set back up, and do it all over again. We still got to focus on these full range of motion, doing it with proper form. Next up, supinated, pronated, supinated, supinated grip, grip lat pull down. I'm trying to keep nice and upright in the torso, squeezing down, pulling, them. I like to pull lower than my chest, engage a lot of that lower lat. We have 12 reps here, so a little bit higher on the reps, supersetting it with a face pull. So again, it's gonna be that rear delt, up into the rhomboids, the traps, um, doing it this way. Again, pull day, we, we oftentimes just focus on and when I when I do when I say shoulders, very few people think of you know rear delt exercises. This is already our second one on a pull day, so I really love switching up the shoulder exercises to push pull. So it's a it's a fun one to switch up. I change my routine about every 12 weeks. Um, gotta keep those muscles confused, right? I know a lot of people out there always love saying that, but really 
it's more because we have different strength progressions that we're going through. Love these days though, love these pulls days. It's good to be a, a pull day on Friday. Go out, nobody wants to do legs on Friday. In the long hard week, save leg day for Saturday morning. Make sure you don't drink too much Friday night. Not me. Some of you guys out there, if you do drink, you can still show off your legs. Alright, moving right along. We got a super set here, rear delts and biceps. We're gonna perform 15 bent over T raise, coming straight out to the side back down. I don't want you to go back behind you or in front of you. Keep it as straight as you can. Try try not to bend your elbows too much. We don't want it here. Almost as straight as not locking out, but just slight, slight bend. Elbow, wrist, shoulder in one line. 15 reps, sitting straight up. Um, I'm going to be switching for a heavier weight. And then we have 15 dumbbell hammer curls. bench trap three raise take in five pounds honestly two and a half would probably be enough get this and then we're super setting with an easy bar cable concentration curl going off the knee something I haven't done in a while um, we got back to back only two sets here 15 reps each 